Does your computer understand you? Let's think about it. Your computer is divided into apps. They have shiny icons and menus and buttons. They're easy enough to use, but that's not how your mind works. You think in sentences. With every click, you're translating your thoughts to fit the app's interface. This might not seem like much, but every time this is breaking your focus and slowing you down. You're living in the future. Couldn't your computer be doing this for you? Hi, my name is Brandon. I've been thinking about this question for years. So I built Lacona, natural language commands for your Mac. I'll show you. First, call it up with a keyboard shortcut. Lacona is unapologetically driven by your keyboard. Voice tools like Siri are great when you're on the go, but when you need to get work done, your keyboard is the best way to do it. Next, type whatever you need to do. Lacona provides intelligent suggestions as you type, so you can use the tab key to complete words and save time. Finally, press return and Lacona follows your orders. It's as simple as that. You can use Lacona to quickly open apps, files, bookmarks, websites, and system preferences. Lacona shows how it understands your command, so you always know exactly what it's going to do. Because the word open is so common, you can usually skip it entirely. Lacona figures out what you mean. You can open multiple items with a single command. You can even specify which app you would like to use to open a file or a URL. Lacona is great at searching the web. Just like the word open, you can usually skip the word search and Lacona will figure out what you mean. You can even search multiple sites at the same time. As you've already seen, Lacona can schedule events and create reminders. In language, there are many ways to say the same thing and Lacona is designed to understand them all. You don't need to remember a specific command syntax. Just type a command exactly as you would say it. Lacona can access your calendar, so it can understand holidays, events, and birthdays. It's the easiest way to enter dates into your computer. You can use Lacona for communication. It can send messages to your contacts, start emails, make FaceTime calls, and if you have an iPhone, even make calls on that. Lacona can also play music in iTunes. You can play artists, albums, genres, composers, or individual songs. You can even pick multiple items to create an impromptu playlist. You can try the fully functional prototype for yourself right now. It can run all of the examples you just saw and more. Check it out on the website, lacona.io. Give it a shot and see what you've been missing. Here's the key, Lacona just works. The simple tasks that you do a thousand times a day no longer force you to translate your thoughts into clicks on a screen. No touching the mouse, no breaking your focus. Just tell Lacona exactly what you're thinking and get on with your day. These features are just the beginning. Lacona will have an open API that will allow anyone to easily create powerful commands. Developers don't need to know anything about processing natural language. They can create commands out of linguistic building blocks that can be easily combined and extended. This means that Lacona's capabilities will grow exponentially. If you can express something in words, you can teach Lacona to do it. Of course, only a small portion of the world speaks English, so Lacona is not tied to any particular language. All of its commands will be open source, so people from around the world will be able to teach Lacona new languages. It will launch with support for US and UK English, but the dream is that one day, everyone will be able to use Lacona in the language that is most natural for them. This is where you come in. This project is not about creating an app. It's about creating a whole ecosystem designed to help people accomplish things better, no matter what they need to do, or what language they speak. The more people get involved, the more powerful and useful Lacona will become. Lacona has been a dream of mine for many years. In January, I left my job to focus on it full time. And it's almost ready. The language processing and the interface are done and you can demo them today. All that's left is to wire to the operating system and release it. 
But to get there, I need your help. Become a part of a community passionate about doing things more simply and elegantly. And help build a world where computers understand us just a little bit better.